I'm Lauren of All Trades, and today I'm flying Southwest. Today we are heading to Florida for our next cruise. We are flying Southwest, which we have been doing pretty regularly now. We used to fly Spirit because of how cheap it was, but they just, their flights were late and like, we were spending so much time on, on or waiting for those flights that it, we found it wasn't worth the savings. So we started flying Southwest, it includes our bags, it's only a little bit more, and the planes are bigger, more leg room. Here's the thing about Southwest. You cannot buy your seat. You can't, there's no way, no matter, there's no amount of money that can buy you your seat. Um, how their boarding works is that you, when you check in for your flight, which you can do as early as 24 hours before your flight, like to the minute, in that order, you get assigned a boarding position. And then literally when you're in the terminal, you're at your gate, you line up in groups by number and board in that order and pick your seat in that order. The one thing that you can pay for is an earlier boarding position. You can pay to be in the A group, there's A, B, and C, um, but you're still lining up and boarding in order. Um, there are some exceptions for um, small children, military, and people who need assistance. They get some priority boarding, um, but yeah. So if you are flying Southwest, set an alarm, put it on your calendar, and be ready to check in exactly 24 hours before your flight so that you get the best position possible. I have been doing this and been pretty successful. The hard part is when you are on a cruise and you need to check in the day before your flight, but you are on board. Um, mostly, I because I do this, I usually have internet I purchased anyway, so I haven't had too many problems with this. Except one, I have to really pay attention to the time on that last day of my cruise when I'm trying to have lots of fun. And also, um, there was one cruise where even the premium, we upgraded to the premium Wi-Fi and it was just garbage. I couldn't load my email, I couldn't load a web page, and I was not able to check in for our cruise until we woke up in the morning and had mo our mobile data. So it wasn't the end of the world, but that was really stressful. We still got to sit together. Like that's the stressful part is like, am I gonna get to sit with my, uh, whoever I'm traveling with? Um, but yeah, I, I didn't know this until my first flight and luckily husband already knew about the process, um, knew to check in right at that 24 hour mark. But if you're flying Southwest for the first time, like this isn't obvious, they don't really talk about it. So that's why I wanted to make this video. We want to take a look at your items. No more than that one personal, one carry-on item. Folks, this sizing box, you know, I'm going to see it a couple times. Everything must fit. This sizing box is not negotiable. It's bigger than this box. It does not go on board the aircraft.
So that was our flight on Southwest. They do give you a free little snack and a soft drink. If you want a whole can of soda, you can ask, but the default is just a cup. Um, instead of doing the little cart down the aisle, that's really hard to like get around if you need to go to the bathroom, they come by and take your order. So it does kind of feel like it takes longer, but it probably ends up being the same from start to finish in amount of time. Um, we really like Southwest because of their baggage policy. You can have up to two checked bags per person included with your fare. And then you also can take on a full-size carry-on and a personal item, which must be smaller. Um, you can look up those sizes and restrictions online. But even the checked bags, it's a 50 pound weight limit versus spirits and some other discount airlines, 40 pound limit. So it's really convenient and stress-free to pack. It's a little bit bad because we get to bring extra stuff and overpack a little bit and then have more bags than we have hands, but we get to bring everything that we want or need for the cruise. Uh, we don't have to like stress about trying to cram it all into small bags and a certain weight limit. That's it for me and my flight on Southwest. <laughs>